barrage of rockets fired at airbase housing U.S. troops in Iraq. At least two people wounded as 14 rockets hit Ain al-Azad airbase in western Iraq. At least 14 rockets hit an airbase in western Iraq hosting U.S. and other international forces on Wednesday, the latest in a series to tit-for-tat strikes with powerful Iran-aligned militias in the country. Colonel Wayne Baroto, spokesman for the U.S.-led coalition, said that Al-Assad Air Base in western Iraq was attacked early in the afternoon by 14 rockets that landed on the base and its perimeter, prompting the activation of defensive measures. A statement from the security media cell, affiliated with Iraq security forces, said a mobile rocket launcher hidden in a truck loaded with bags of flour and parked in the nearby village of Baghdadi was used in the attack. It out of the 14 rockets were fired towards the base while the rest exploded on the truck, damaging some village homes and a mosque. A previously unknown group calling itself Brigades to Avenge al Muhandis said its members fired 30 rockets towards the base run by American occupiers. It added a message to U.S. troops, we will force you to leave our lands defeated. The group is named after Iraqi militia leader Abu Mahdi al Muhandis, who was killed last year in U.S. drone attack in Baghdad, along with top Iranian General Ghassan Soleimani. Iraq's government called it a terrorist attack and a flagrant violation of Iraqi laws. Thanks for tuning in and watching the video. Please like, share and subscribe to get latest updates as it happens.